Hello little artist, I'm Mariana Olsen and today we are drawing a folding surprise picture. Are you ready? Let's do this! Ok, we are going to need paper, something to color with, I'm using markers and something to draw with. I will use a black marker that you can change for a pencil. I'm going to start folding the paper in half, then we are going to take the bottom part and fold in half again. Now we are going to flip it over and fold one more time and then we are going to open it you're gonna flip it and we're gonna start drawing right here. Okay, little artist, we're gonna start with this picture for Easter. I hope you like this lesson and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss lessons step by step like this one. Let's start with the paper close like this and we're gonna do the cloud that is in the outside. We're gonna start going here in the center doing big curves that go to the right. And as we get closer to the folding part, we're going to go these curves smaller. Let's go to the other side and do the same thing. Now we're going to cross the folding part and we're going to do one more curve here. And we're going to continue doing curves. And now we're going to do the bigger ones in the middle. And now let's continue going up with a smaller curves. I'm just going to leave this like this. Now let's open the paper. And we're going to start on the bottom. We're going to cross the folding part and do a curve. One more. And these are the big ones. And now we're going down. Before we finish the top part, we're going to start with Jesus down here. We're going to do a, a square and it's going to go down. And now we're going to go to the right, over the cloud, and up again. We're leaving a space right here. Now let's do the face and it's going to be a big letter U that cross the folding part going from the left to the right and going up again. Here we're going to connect my uh, body to the head. Now let's do the hair. So we're going to go in the middle and a little bit to the right. We're going to put a little dot. It's about two finger space between the folding part and the dot. Now we're going to go down and curving like this. We're going to pass the line of the face. We're going to go down curving and connecting with the line. From here, we're going to do the ears. We're going to do one and two curves. And now let's do the arms. We're going to go from this corner down and doing a square. Now from this, going down the same. For the hands, we're going to just do two curves right here. One for the thumb and one for the hand. Underneath here, we're going to do two lines for the legs. And in the middle, he has a piece of fabric that go across just like this. Now that we have the body, we can finish the hair. We're going to go from this point up a little and we're going to put the dot about a finger space between the folding part and the dot. Now we're going to go down. We're going to curve passing the ear and now we're going to start doing curves up and down. Just like this. Now let's go the same thing here going down. We're going to pass the ear. We're going to start curving here. Next we're going to do the beard and we're going to do a half a circle inside just like this. We're going to do an oval shape inside. And inside the oval shape, we're going to put a smile. Let's continue with the eyes and we're going to do two oval shapes. We're going to start here over the folding part doing one. And here two. And we're going to put uh, two little circles. One on the top and a little one underneath one on the top and one underneath and we're going to fill with black around these two the last thing we're going to do here is two eyebrows and i'm going to go under the hair doing rectangle shapes and this one for example is just showing a little bit and it's going under the hair let's finish the cloud that is on the top and i'm just going to do the curves if your character is too close to the folding part, you can pass the clouds or the curves behind his head. 
And now we're gonna make it look more like the sky by doing more clouds. So here I'm gonna do another one. And in behind his head, I'm gonna do the last cloud. Remember that they can have different shapes. And the very last thing I almost forget, we're gonna do a tiny nose here on top of the beard with a curved shape. And there, that's it. We finished Jesus when he rises to heaven. Now let's see how it looks when we close it. And this is how it looks when we open. I hope you like this lesson. And now my favorite part is coming. Let's go, Lord. Okay, little artists, we are done. This is how my pictures turn out. In here, I add a ray of light that comes from the top to the bottom. Now, let's take a look inside, and this is how it looks. Here is Jesus, when he's rising to heaven, and the ray of light goes in behind him, and it goes bigger on the bottom. You can add more details to this picture. You can put some blue for the sky or add a message. So, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss lessons step-by-step step like this one. See you next time!